Scientists have chased a theory for decades, Planet 9. Also referred to as Planet X may exist but is it a ghost planet, a black hole, or a newfound planet? But that's just one of the many terms used to describe Planet 9, a hypothetical mystery world. If it is discovered, it would be the first newfound planet to be recognized within the solar system since 1846. So let's discuss about Planet 9. Where did the idea of Planet 9 originate? In the early 1900s, astronomers believed Planet 9 could exist as it would offer an explanation for the wobbles in the orbits of Uranus and Neptune. The gravitational pull of another planetary body was thought to be responsible and so when Pluto was discovered in 1930, scientists believed this was the ghost planet they'd been seeking, so the search was over. However, the hunt restarted when further research revealed that Pluto was too small to affect Neptune and Uranus. Based on data collected from Voyager 2's flyby of Neptune in 1989, NASA announced that there were no anomalies in the orbits of the outer planets at all, they were not rogue. So, at this stage, it seemed that they had been searching for something that did not exist. Where could this ghost planet be? In 1992, the Kuiper Belt was discovered and with its study came more signs that Planet 9 may well exist. This vast region of the solar system beyond Neptune is believed to contain hundreds of thousands of icy bodies larger than 100 kilometers across, as well as a trillion or more comets. Pluto is the best known of the larger objects here, with Quaor, Sedna, and Eris discovered between 2002 and 2005 and all four were classified as dwarf planets in 2006. Scientists noted that Sedna travels in a long, elliptical orbit that takes 11,000 years to complete. What pulls Sedna in this direction? Could it be another world with a strong gravitational pull Planet 9? Discovery of Planet 9 In 2016, Mike Brown and Constantine Batigan from the California Institute of Technology, Caltech, posited the existence of a planet with a mass between five and six times than that of Earth. The idea being that this planet was pulling not only Sedna but five other objects, all tilted at the same angle and in the same direction. The mass of Planet 9 had already been estimated based on the apparent force of its gravitational pull, so scientists went on to theorize what it looks like. Based on their idea of its mass and also its position in space, they say it is either a rocky super-Earth, or a gaseous mini-Neptune. Also sharing characteristics with Uranus or Neptune, making it an icy planet with a solid core. Why can't we find it? Scientists predicted, an orbit of Planet 9 based on the movement of the objects, they believe it is affecting, but pinpointing it still isn't going to be easy. Its elusive nature suggests, that it's at the far edge of its, enormous orbit, meaning it's unlikely, to be reflecting much light from the Sun. As such, it will remain in shadow, hidden within the sparkling starfield of the Milky Way. But, it'd still be possible to see it using existing telescopes. What are we using to find it? To aid in their search for Planet 9, astronomers are using the powerful 8.2 meter Subaru telescope that sits on Hawaii's dormant volcano Mauna Kea. Whilst it is currently one of the best options available for success, the team is only allocated around three nights a year to use Subaru. NASA's Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite, TESS, may also catch sight of Planet 9 as it continually searches for planets orbiting other stars, but the best hope lies with the Vera Rubin Observatory, currently under construction in Chile. In 2023, this 8.4 meters telescope will begin taking photographs of the entire visible sky, two-thirds of the whole sky, uniformly and repeatedly every few nights. This will enable astronomers to track the movements of celestial objects from the mountaintop observatory and maybe spot Planet 9 at the same time. New analysis by scientists predict that Planet 9 could be brighter and closer to us than previously thought. They now think its orbit is much tighter, taking 7,400 years to travel around the Sun rather than 18,500 years, as previously estimated. This makes the chances of discovery, if it is, indeed there, significantly improved. What do the scientists say? Some believe it isn't even a planet, but a primordial black hole, one of the compressed masses that formed during the very first second of our universe's existence. 
Black holes are some of the densest objects in the universe, making it possible that it is rather than a planet and is affecting the orbits of other masses. Other astronomers are convinced that Planet 9 is simply natural bias in sky surveys. They say that ascribing the existence of a planet to the observations around gravitational orbit is risky because until we know more about these objects, we cannot know if they really are behaving strangely. As searches for this elusive planet have proved fruitless, critics contend that signs of Planet 9 are nothing more than ghosts in the data. Will we crack the mystery of Planet 9? The existence of this distant world is only theoretical at this point and no direct observation of the object nicknamed, Planet 9 inches have been made. The ability of these past sky surveys to detect Planet 9 was dependent on its location and characteristics. Further surveys of the remaining regions are ongoing using the 8.2-meter Subaru telescope and other space projects. Unless Planet 9 is observed, its existence remains purely conjectural. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment and share this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel for more interesting space videos.